So guys, this is my 100th video. Sorry that it's absolutely roast, well not roasting, but it's it's really sunny out here actually. So there's a bright, sh bright light just behind me. Um, my 100th video, I didn't realise until I put the latest episode of the podcast up that it was my 99th video. So I figured I might do something just just a sort of just a general chat, as I usually do, but something that means a bit more for my 100th video. Um, as of when you're watching this, um, the funeral of Bradley Larry will take place tomorrow's Thursday evening I'm recording this, so it's going to be tomorrow by the time the funeral comes along. Um, and it's I'm hoping people go just to pay their respects to the kid because, um, you know, he, he has taught everybody a lot. And I think... The, the only, I wouldn't say anything good to come from him dying because it's never a good thing but I'd like to hope at least that as a result from Brad, the Bradley Larry's experience that um, let's see if this is better from Bradley Larry's experience that you've got cancer research and everything and rare types of cancer there's more funding going into trying to cure them and making sure that this doesn't happen to anybody um, or well, certainly as little people as possible rather but um Bradley, rest in peace, mate. I did, I'd said I wasn't really going to talk very much about it, just more out of respect for his family more than anything. But it's... I think he does this to me 100 I wanted to mention it. So, Bradley, rest in peace, mate. Um, you will never, ever be forgotten. And I watched the True Jordy's video, actually, on him, and I don't. I rarely watch his videos anymore. But this was but it was on Facebook, I think it's his tribute to Bradley Larry, and he's spot on. Everything he says about the kid is spot on, because... He achieved a lot in the six years he was here, and he will undoubtedly never be forgotten. And this is one of the things, this backs my argument, football is never just a game. Look at how many fans were united behind Bradley's cause. I've never seen so many fans come and unite together in something, in anything before, let alone this. And I will give a shout out to Jermaine Defoe, he won't be watching this, but he's he was great with the guy. Sunderland handled things well as well, and Everton, I'll give a special mention to them. They didn't, they didn't have any connection to the kid originally. And look what they did for Bradley, honestly. You know, and Bradley got to manage England as a mascot. You know, so good on him for that. But rest in peace, man. Honestly, you deserve it. And I will quickly mention, thank you to everybody who watches. Um, I understand, you know, I mean, and especially to the pod, those who watch the podcast that me, Pete and Ben have started now. And um, we're hoping to try and get more guests on as the season progresses. And obviously, as the season comes upon us, we want to try and get fans of different clubs on. Whether that happens or not remains to be seen. And even if it's shit and nobody watches it and nobody likes it, we just like talking about Sullen, so we ain't going anywhere, I don't plan to. But thanks to anyone who watches, honestly. Um, my videos aren't usually that great of quality anyway, but they don't really don't mean anything unless people actually want to sit and watch them. So thank you to everybody who watches. Um, that's all I can say, really. This is my 100th video. And the last way to conclude it, there's only one Bradley Lowry. See you later.